Okay, so the next thing that we're going to talk about today is how to use Canva to design your graphs and customize graphs of your choice and then use it for your content. So to start with, you just come to your search bar also and search for graphs. There are different kind of graphs. There is bar charts, there is line charts, there is a histogram and, and there about. Okay, so you can check different kind of graphs. But let's say we'll go with graph in general. So using the grapher. So you can start a fresh graph from here or you can check accordingly to any graph of your choice that you feel like can depict what you want to put in in your content. You can check different kind of flow charts and all other sort of graphs. So let's say as you move, you can see this uh, sort of bar chart. Okay, so you just click on it and we can see the bar chart coming up. Okay, so this is it on a separate sheet. Once you just click on the chart, you just double click on the chart you can see the features coming out once you click on the graph you can see the features coming out this is the items item one item two item three and you can change them accordingly this is option one option two option three and these are the series the data in the series this is data series one this is series two and you can check go ahead and see series three and you can you can even add more data if you want so depending on your choice so once you just select any one can just play around with the value and maybe instead of 10 here you can put 50 and you can see it has affected the whole thing it has changed the whole thing and then you can make this maybe 35 or 25 or thereabout and you can see it has changed this is series 2 item 2 and you can see you can change this one or this one to maybe 16 or thereabout and you can see it has changed it so depending on what you want to play around with, you can easily edit the data accordingly, or you can do it individually as well. You can just select and change it to maybe this is 10,000, all right? You can just change it just like so, and you can change it accordingly. You can clear the data and put in another one, and you can change the bar charts. You can make it a graph of X versus, versus Y, or they are about, Okay, management practice is to improve. You can put any description from here and you can change this to maybe week one and maybe this is week two and maybe this is week three. So depending on your message and your brand, you can change the coloration from here. You can just select and change the color to anything of your choice. Maybe you can insert blue or you can change this also to any color of your choice. Maybe you know, this is the normal color. You can insert black and change this also to any color of your choice, maybe this one. And then you can easily bring it out and you can download it accordingly. So one another thing that I want to show you is once you are on the graph, you can come to settings over here and you can show legends if you want. You can see the legends at the bottom showcasing the colors that you are dealing with. And this time around, you have to change, click to change the coloration of whatever you are targeting. You can enable legend, you can show labels if you want. You can see the labels coming out, item one, item two, item three. This is a series of a thing, but I think the labels at this point may not be that important. You can show grid lines or you can unshow them. Okay, show or unshow, you can see them. And you can plot columns as series or plot rows as series. You can change it accordingly. You can change it to columns or to rows according to your message. So whatever you have, you can play around with it. We can see other, ch other charts also from here. Okay, you can see other types of types of chart like the people graph containing gender and all that so once you click on this you can see it's going to open and this is another type of chart that works collaboratively with the female and male percentage there about this is the gender chart so you can click on it and to have an idea from the table so this is the arrange okay so you can give it any definition you can change this to any value maybe it's 19 or there about and once you hit you can see it is changing the age range the name range okay from 18 to 21 21 to age range from 18 to 21 21 to 30 31 to 35 and 45 and above you can see the female number of female and number of male maybe this is 10 you can just adjust it and say this is 10 and then you can see you can change the brand coloration as well on all the cases you can change on this one and you can see you can change it to anything of your choice but i think the previous one is much better so you can you're free to change it accordingly click and you can change uh, this one you can change it to something like this and now it's much more visible and you can change this also to to something like that 
so it becomes visible so you can see it and you can go ahead and play around with the other changes as well you can change this chart chart the, the level you can double click and change it to maybe gender variation and you can select and remove reduce the sizing to anything and i think you can do you can change the background coloration either to white or to something much better so it becomes much clearer and you can see your graph Depending on your content, depending on your message, you can easily come here and customize something to mean something according to your message. So you can easily play around with the charts, with the table, you can clear the data, you can link this with your Google Sheet, you can link them and you can play around with the features as well. So there are a bunch of things that you can play around with over here. Let's try to see if we can find some line graphs. So in our search, you can see we have some line graphs that are free, but the paid ones also, you can try to redesign if you want. So we can see this one is, is a line chart. So we try to click on it. And let's see, you can just change the heading accordingly. You can just change it and maybe make it marketing report. All right, so January 2022. And you can see once you click on the graph, you have access to the table. You can delete any table of your choice, any row. You can select and delete any row or you can change the values accordingly. Maybe this is 50. You can see it has changed everything. Can play around with it just like we've explained you can enable the legends if you want from here and you can see the legends at the top you can show the plots horizontal or plots columns as series anyone you want and you can play around with the brand also you can change it according to your own personal brand and everything is going to be changed accordingly so once you change it and uh, you can give the image a background you can change the background to something that can fit yeah, this kind of looks cool. And from here, yeah, I think I prefer this. You can easily come over and click on download and you can download it very, very easily. You can just download. This is this uh, line graph. You can go back to your to this other uh, bar chart and just click and just download in PDF. Okay, share. And then you can download. You can make it in PDF or you can go to PNG or JPEG. Let's say PNG, just click to download. Now downloading, and you can come to the other one, the other bar chart also. You can just easily come over here and download it very nicely and fantastically. And you can insert it to your document very easily. So you can see this, this first one, downloaded the bar chart and you can see the clarity and everything. So you can just copy it and paste it on the other document or any other document that you want to put depending on your story. So you can check this other one as well. You can see it very clearly. You can just copy it also and paste it in your Microsoft Word document or in your presentation or wherever you have the document that you want to present. So this is about graphs. Feel free to try it. Feel free to customize it to anything of your choice. You can equally clear the data and put your data like I said. Okay, so feel free to experience it and see what you can do with graphs in Canva.